What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another edition of Smash Cup Media where I cover all things how to YouTube. In today's video, I'm going to be covering a topic that has been pretty popular on YouTube as far as growing your channel, and that is Sprizzy. Sprizzy promises to get you more views, to get you more subs, to get you more watch time. If you're new to YouTubing, if you're new to uh, growing your channel and you see all these ads and you just hastily go into Sprizzy and spend all your money, you're gonna to wanna to watch this video first because I'm gonna review Sprizzy versus another website that's very similar to Sprizzy, which is called Views Arena. I'm gonna compare them side by side. So first, let's start with Sprizzy. Let's go in like we're gonna make a new video. So you're gonna type in your channel name, all your videos are gonna pop up and you're just gonna pick a video that you want uh, to promote. So this is Sprizzy, it's telling you how it's gonna look here. It's gonna ask you a few questions. Um, besides views, what's your primary goal? We're gonna stick with subscribers here. Uh, choose a language, English. Um, let Sprizzy build and write my ad for me. We're gonna stick with that. Uh, are you promoting a band or song? No. Choose country, United States. Uh, and these are all my, um, my tags. You can add or delete tags. I'm just gonna leave it as is. It's gonna tell you, set your budget to $100 and get 10% more views for free. Okay, I don't wanna do that. Let's say I wanna start with $10. Wait, you can't start with $10 because minimum is $50. You have to pay at least $50 to run your first campaign. So with that $50, you're gonna get anywhere from 1,000 111 views and 2222 views so how fast do you want it fast one to two days normal three to seven or slower seven to ten so if you decide to go with sprizzy and run your campaign i wouldn't do it faster one to two days yeah it sounds nice getting your views quick but you're gonna want to let uh sprizzy do its thing as far as finding your audience so if you do have time, I would go slower seven to 10 days because that's gonna weed a lot of your audience that aren't gonna watch your videos or that aren't gonna sub. It's gonna give you a little bit more, um, a higher quality viewers. Okay, so we're gonna go with save and continue. Okay, so from here, um, you're gonna enter your credit card info and uh, your campaign will start, right? But we're not gonna do that yet. From here, I'm gonna go to views arena. So again, it doesn't matter what video you put, okay. I do have a Views Arena review standalone all by itself, so be sure to check that out on my channel. But what's interesting about Views Arena is it has the same backend as Sprizzy. So I think it's the same company, like the same corporation, just with a different website presence, a different online presence, a different online name. So it's gonna ask you, besides Views, What's your secondary goal? It asks you the same exact thing on Sprizzy. So we're gonna say subscribers, budget, okay? Set your budget to $100 and get 20% more views for free. So remember, on Sprizzy, it was $100, get 10% more. But we don't wanna do that. We don't wanna spend a lot of money, right? So let's say you wanna set your budget to $10. You can't do that again. Minimum is 25. Now remember, on Sprizzy, the minimum was 50. What do you get with this $25? Look at this. You'll receive between 3,650 views and 4,350 views. So that's right off the bat, you're spending half of what you were gonna spend on Sprizzy and you're gonna receive at least 2,000 more views. So you're spending half and you're gonna get at least 2,000 more views. Okay, so next we're gonna go with targeting. Uh, targeted by country. We're gonna go with the United States. Content, is it a regular video or is it a music video? Remember, Sprizzy asks you the same thing. Which keywords or phrases describe your video best? Okay, you're gonna add from this video. Okay. I'm going to total budget 25, $25, and it dropped me down to 1,360 views and 1,450 views, which is weird because on the previous page, it was telling me a minimum of 3,000 views, 3,000 whatever it was. So I'm not sure why I would do that. So let's go to preview ad here. Look at this layout here. This layout is the same layout 
Esprizzi. So we go to, this was Esprizzi, right? And it's the same layout, look at this. So if I go here, it's gonna go there. If I go here, as commercial, Esprizzi. So again, I'm thinking it's the same company or they're using the same software developer um, both these companies are to make their website because it's very similar. So again, I'm not sure why it dropped me back down to 1360 views and 1450, but even if you take it at 1360 to 1450, that's still half the price and you're getting the same views as you would on Sprizzy for $25 less or half the price of your total campaign. So if I were to choose between the two, I would definitely go with Views Arena. Now I have gone with both. So the campaign I ran here on Sprizzy is uh, this video I have here, Curb Find. Um, I received 3,500 views and 27 subscribers. Now the reason I did this is because I was seeing all the ads on YouTube, not even comparing prices or comparing websites. I just went in and did this campaign. This campaign for 3,500 views cost me $110. $110 right here. This is something that I wouldn't do again. I wouldn't recommend doing. So Views Arena, I ran this ad here, which got me 820 views and I only spent $12. So if I would have spent about 40 bucks, I would have got the same views off of Views Arena that I got with Sprizzy. So if I were to do it all over again, I would just do my my campaigns with Views Arena. I am gonna set up a campaign right now. So I will make another video on how this campaign is going. But if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. Check out all my other videos on my channel of websites just like this. I do a lot of different reviews. You're definitely gonna save some money if you're looking to grow your YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Check you on the next one.